What is going on guys? Proplan Apathy back in the building with another video and today I actually have a different type of video and it's a really, really, actually important subject in my opinion because it's something you guys should know. Now I know a majority of you obviously follow Call of Duty, obviously um, you know care about certain attachments, certain classes and the reason I found this out was all thanks to Drifter. Uh, if you guys know who Drifter is, he's like, he basically breaks down like stats for weapons and I'll leave the original video in the chat below. But for the competitive players, or just for any any Call of Duty player in general, something has changed in the Call of Duty community. Now, whether you want to use it, whether you think it's drastic, is your opinion. You can try it for yourself. But, it's ELO and Reflex needed? Like, do we need those things anymore? And by the way, I'm playing Spire. First time playing this map, it looks pretty cool so far. But, are those things needed anymore? Like, if you guys have noticed what scope I'm using, I'm actually using the Varix. I hate nades. <laughs> I'm actually using the Varix scope. And the reason why, well, it's actually a really important reason why I'm using the scope. If you guys didn't know, apparently, the Varix scope now, I guess it was like a secret. Oh, shit. I guess it was like a secret update that they did. Well, apparently, it helps reduce the recoil. So, you get almost to none recoil on this weapon which i find actually pretty damn insane like i'm not even using grip on this gun right now i am legit not using grip and look how how like my gun just barely recoils whatsoever and it's it's literally insane that they found this out and i, I find it actually really interesting really cool that this exists now for us pro players for us people who play competitive is this something that is going to change or are we still going to use the elo sites or are we going to switch to varix now What's gonna go on? Well, for a lot of you guys know, I actually tried this in pubs a lot lately. It's been feeling nice. And to go in further detail, the Varic scope actually... Oh, let me let me use this hater real quick. Oh, nope, nope, you're not getting me! No, baby! I'm trying to still understand this map. I'm sorry, guys. But the Varic scope actually... It's it's like better... Alright, so... Alright, let me let me try to explain it the best I can. There's also the bow site. The bow 3 site. A lot of you guys know about that site. Well, that side also helps reduce recoil, but you can stack a grip on it. Now, the difference with the Varic Scope, you cannot stack grip at all on it. You have to use it only... Well, I mean, you can use grip, but... Oh, no, no. Why? It's keep nading, man. You can use Varix. I mean, you can use um, grip on it, but it's not going to help the Varic site whatsoever. It's not going to, like, reduce the recoil somehow. It's just going to keep it the same. So pretty much what you want to do on the Varic site, what you really want to do is you want to make sure to not use grip and just stack attachments on it. Also, if you notice on the Varic site, there's two ways. There's there's a looking like a zoomed in one and there's a zoomed out one. Obviously, if you're playing competitive or just playing in general, you always want to use a zoomed out one. All you have to do is press a uh, circle, I believe, on your controller. I, I don't know. I use scuff paddles. A lot of you guys know this by now. And holy shit, I am tearing up this game i'm just trying to stay alive here got another raps and another hater holy shit i am fucking going completely off the varic scope is the best and this is just the best gun in the game in general i mean who does not like the man award this is one good ass class they can't even kill me dude this is this is truly amazing so when using the boa site if you think oh well the varix sucks i really don't like using the varix well what you can actually do is you can use the boa site which is kind of similar to a red dot site and then all you have to do is add grip on it so it's like having the varix where it actually like reduces the recoil even more because you're stacking two things on it so you have the boa site and grip and i don't know the fuck they're flying to and i don't want to die because i think I think I'm actually pretty close to a nuclear, so I'm trying my best not to die here. I don't know. I'm 43 and 3 right now. I'm having a phenomenal game. First time playing this map on top of that. Like, holy shit. This is fucking crazy. Fucking crazy. Okay, I got another hater. Let me get a gun as well. Oh, we got a VMP in our hands. Now, now we're talking, baby. Now we're fucking talking. This is... No, man, no, damn it. Oh, I was so close. I had it been so close to getting a nuclear, 100%. Best gun in the game right here, guys. Best fucking gun in the game. So pretty much what this means also to clarify some stuff. If you're using the Varic scope, 
it's pretty much like using grip but better but to, to like add to that on top of that you don't have to use like grip you can actually put a different attachment on top of that so it's like it depends i mean it depends if you like varic scope if you hate it if you think it's too zoomed in etc i mean in the end of the day it's also preference like it, i mean it might be better but the scope sucks the scope sucks but on top of that like i said like it's just it's really beneficial if you think about it because on top of having a very scope it's pretty much like grip on your weapon if you're watching this video right now i do not have grip on and a lot of you guys know the man of war recoils a little bit like it's it's not the best gun long range but it's literally not moving at all so pretty much looks like i'm using grip but i don't have grip on whatsoever i'm just rocking the gun and i, I hate these psychosis bots i have no idea where they're coming from just, just a man on a mission right now. Just a man on a mission. Just a man on a mission. And he's trying to take down my shit. Holy fuck. I am having such a phenomenal game. These guys are probably slowly quitting. I'm 68 and 4. I don't know what the hell that guy was doing. Oh, three piece. So now, does this change the meta? Does this mean no longer ELO or reflex sight or whatever, whatever the case is? Doesn't necessarily mean that because a lot of players probably still prefer ELO, still pr probably prefer Reflex just because it's better when it comes to aiming. Uh, I mean, maybe on bigger maps, you know, Varic Scope, a BOA, BOA3 Scope, it might be a little bit helpful. But, you know, it's just something for you guys to know. It's actually pretty crazy how Varic Scope reduces the recoil drastically. Just remember, you can't stack it. You can't, can't stack it with Grip. But the Boa 3 Sight also reduces the recoil a little bit less than the Varic does. But yes, you can put grip on it, so it helps. It's almost like bow sight with grip. I'm pretty sure it's like almost equivalent to the Varic scope. But either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Pure dominant gameplay, 76 and 4. My fucking god. I'm the Pub Star King. Ain't nobody better than me. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out. Peace.